All reactions are on Patreon. First, once you can pull up your copy of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, Episode 6 of Season 1, Ghostbusters, and press play on it when I press play. The timer reaches zero. So, I don't remember what happens in this one, but based on title alone, someone's going to get a little full of themselves, you know, talk up their game, and someone's going to take them to task. Hey, you could have helped out that guy from the first episode. He was just so happy with that. <laughs> Aww. No! <laughs> My hotness! <laughs> I do like how the intro starts with Twilight and Spike coming down in the balloon. That is a nice little connecting thread for everything. Da da da. Twenty-five bottles of beer on a wall. You gotta be the best! That's right! Good motivation. Hopefully she doesn't take it too far. I very sincerely doubt that. <laughs> she was so happy with that. She was embarrassed. These two remind you of those, uh, two workers from Monsters, Inc. who were obsessed with Sully. Ooh, is it, oh, uh, what's her name? The Magician, yeah. I remember liking her. Yes. The great and powerful Trixie! I remember liking you a lot. <laughs> oh yeah, and I remember being annoyed! Because it's like, it's a magic show! <laughs> like... Actually, guys, I suck! Anyway, magic trick time! Wait, what the heck? I... <laughs> like, there's an understanding at these sorts of shows. Like, I don't go watch a guy doing card tricks and being like, Ah! Ah! How dare you talk up your ability? I remember being so annoyed by by them in this episode. Naysayers. It's, it's a fucking magic show! Jesus Christ! <laughs> like, what, where do you, how do you think this level of anger is justified? I take the side of the performer! Be gone, peasants! <laughs> Doing a bit of a Gilderoy Lockhart nonsense, I suppose.
<laughs> well, same kind of characters, too, as the ones from Monsters, Inc. Mr. Sullivan! That was a Beetlejuice thing. Like, I guess she's feeding her own ego and, yeah, whatever, bad personality trait. But in this circumstance, anyone genuinely getting upset is weird. Now nah, she's inviting it. Before now, main cast are the bad guys. You're acting like she's traveling around town saying this. She's got a stall. The traveling carnival type thing. Well, that's just a bad choice. Now, <laughs> take her to task. <laughs> It'd be hysterical, though. She's like, yeah, I grew up on a farm, and she did the exact same thing. Like, no other talents to compare to the <laughs> to Applejack or anything like that, but, like, very particularly, that ended up being a bad choice. Oh, come on. I know I sound so annoyed, but at the same time, I'm having so much fun with this character. So. <laughs> it's a stage! That's the whole job! Okay, Dashbo Rain thing, let's do this. Is I, I, isn't there some way she's doing this that's cheating? Either way, that was super cool. Ah, ah. I accepted your prior, but that was just mean. Can you call Celestia? I would die if that's the joke they made. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good too. And you're great at handling hecklers, too. This, that's what's up. <laughs> Dude, she just used a rainbow to, to attack Rainbow Dash. She, she's got a sense of humor. A uh, scarier than Grace. Ugly! What you do? What? How bad is it? It didn't look that bad in the close-up. It's just like my- Oh, okay, no, it's not just like yours. Green and purple go well together. Maybe not that shade of- <laughs> Keep it simple, stupid!
Man, this still ultimately ends up being the crowd's fault. Showing up and getting mad over someone doing a performance. <laughs> oh god. Glad you think that's weird too. A big bear? <laughs> Everything during the show would be fine if she just showed the slightest bit of humility outside the performance. But they didn't know that she was like this outside the performance! Like, you're taking a stand-up comedian, pa, he's just showing off telling these jokes. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh no. You idiots. I'm sure it's happened. A jar of fleas, probably somewhere. Like y'all, your friends kind of right, put themselves in that situation, mostly. You guys are so dumb. What's the snail and the scissors imply for your talents? <laughs> it's like starting a lawnmower or a chainsaw. Ooh, it is a big bear. I like that, and it's constellation styled. <laughs> Just figured that one out, huh? I was napping till spring. Jesus Christ, that's a lot of knocks. <laughs> oh, man, not the cart. It's a magic show! Do you not understand what entertainment is?
A. <laughs> oh, no. I will not have anyone blame her for this thing showing up. Bah! Yeah, you're about to be impressed by Twilight. This is still your fault, not hers. Someone says I stopped an armed gunman one time. I'm not gonna go get another one so they can prove it. Well, that's one way to do it. Everything about his design is so cool, except the eyes, which I do like, but I think they could fit the overall uh, design better. Oh, so much for that water. <laughs> oh, that was wow. <laughs> oh, that's what she was doing it for. That's, wow, that seemed like it was a lot further away than that. Performance. Whooping? I mean, I feel like whooping is the, the wrong verb. <laughs> and we're blaming these two, yes? Hopefully you don't have to find out anytime soon. <laughs> Be gone myself. <laughs> About not performing in front of crowds. Oh God, yeah, she has so much to learn. <laughs> That's right. Hmm. 
<laughs> what was that one again at the start of the episode? <laughs> the mustache. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Never perform on stage. It is anti-friendship. It is against the laws of friendship. <laughs> I assure you, it does not help. <laughs> I know I spent the entire time bitching, but I had a lot of fun watching this one. <laughs> Shoot! I don't know if it's a season one episode, but isn't there an episode where she is powerful, but it's because she's uh, cheating? I don't want to look it up, because any episodes I did see beyond season one, I haven't seen most of them, so I'm trying to totally go dark on that, but same time, I want to know now. Like, that did happen, right? Either way, I think Trixie is awesome, so I'm hoping there's a lot more of her next time.